Use workers from eight countries – Bulgaria, Croatia, Italy, Latvia, Poland, Romania, Spain and Ukraine are participated in the Nature in Education – Education in Nature project as part of the Erasmus Plus program. The mobility event took place in May at the Agrotourism Center Heistra in Huta Polanska, located in the low baskets of southeastern Poland, Jaslo country. Beskidniski is the one of the wildest region in Poland, situated near the border with Slovakia. It is highly ecological and attractive area, perfect for relaxation after workshops, jogging, Nordic walking and leisurely walks. My name is Ksenia. This is my first uh, Erasmus Plus project experience and it was very positive. We are practically in nature. We are immersed in a wonderful um, atmosphere. We did a lot of activities that had to do with uh, um, connecting with nature, connecting with yourself, grounding yourself um, and um, I don't know, just simply feeling good with yourself. And um, I experienced very nice things. I made friends. Uh, I'm probably going to bring this experience with me for a while. And I hope to do something similar like to this in the future. My name is David. I'm from Romania. Uh, this is my first time in an Erasmus project. Uh, currently, right now in Poland, it is my first time being here. Uh, during this project, I um, found a lot of new friends and I created some very interesting friendships, which I think I will value for the uh, remainder of my youth, per se. Also, the nature here is quite amazing and also the campfires, the, the going out and the, were so pleasant. I'm very happy to be here. The course lasted 10 days, with 32 youth workers participating. Their participants included youth workers as well as leaders, trainers, teachers, educators involved in ecological and nature education with nature therapy. They were motivated to pass on the acquired knowledge to young people in their organization and countries. The schedule was very rich and included field activity, collaborative work at the center, study visits and cultural evenings. Hello, my name is Olivia. This is my first Erasmus project and the title is Nature in Education, Education in Nature. And for me it's important because um, I love nature and connecting with, with surroundings. And I also met so many wonderful people and the project helped me to deal with anxiety, with social anxiety and showed us ways to how to deal with certain difficulties in our lives, for example, with depression. So it's, it's really important for other people. And also, I think that I will be participating in other projects in the future. Hi guys, I'm Kristina and I'm from Ukraine. I'm from the Medical Kiev University and I'm really happy that I'm here. Thank you for support of the Erasmus instructors and Erasmus facilitators for giving us the helpful hand for all three days because we were really awkward. But now we are really like a family with all the countries, with other participants that took part in Erasmus Plus. So I'm really grateful that I'm here and it's so cool to be here. So I wish you come here too guys. Bye bye! The project was practical and allowed people working with youth to learn and apply their proposed tool and method in their professional lives. The workshops were based on non-formal education. The working methods included nature and forest education, natural pedagogy with elements of survival, forest therapy including elements of foreign bathing conducted during educational classes in the forest, basics of zootherapy and nature handicrafts. Moreover, the project covered soft tourism and educational tourism. An important topic of the course was preventing burnout among educators and maintaining mental health among young people. Um, hello, my name is Maria. This is my Erasmus project number four. And I select this project because they say me that we work with uh, nature and with horse and I am riding horse teacher and I really love this. Uh, the program is one of the best that I uh, participated. Uh, we have uh, really good uh, trainers and we um, 
have a really perfect contact with the nature and the animals. Hello, my name is Ivanka. I'm from Bulgaria. Thank you for this possibility to take part in this beautiful project. I received so, so many knowledge about bird, animal, uh, burnout uh, therapy, forest uh, therapy, self-control, self-care. I feel uh, so good uh, um, in this uh, beautiful place. Uh, my sending organization is uh, Hell Grove. Uh, this uh, project is uh, 14 for me. I uh, have been in Turkey, Serbia, and now uh, this is my pleasure to be in uh, Poat. Participants had the opportunity to learn about good practices and exchange experience in involving young people in ecological activities. There was also time for getting to know each other, integrating and learning about the cultures of different countries and nations. Hi, my name is Katrin, I'm from Latvia and now I'm at Huta Palanska. We spent here 10 wonderful days uh, in program Nature in Education and it was really amazing time because we have a lot of interesting practice uh, about uh, ourselves, uh, how to anti-stress us. Uh, we love uh, the nature, we explore the nature here, we know, now we know new plants uh, which uh, are growing in this beautiful forest. Uh, we try national food uh, from the Poland and also we have a really interesting intercultural night when we sharing our traditions, cultures and food and it was amazing. Uh, also we have uh, some interesting uh, practice for the hobby. We do some uh, handcrafts and uh, we will take it at home and uh, I really thank you for that because now I have some gifts for my friends. And uh, I want to say thank you for the organization this uh, interesting project in uh, this beautiful place. Uh, it was really important and um, uh, helpful for ourselves. Uh, to be here in the fresh air, near the animals, near the nature, uh, feel it, touch it and uh, explore it together. And uh, I will take this experience in my life. I will use it with uh, kids uh, and uh, in our organization with youths uh, because it's really important to connect it, uh, to be connected in the nature, with nature and feel it and also use it for the relaxation. Uh, so I'm really thankful for the, all of we learn here and I wish we will meet uh, new times and maybe we will organize some projects together. Partner organizations have many years of experience working with youth. They promote the principles of ecological tourism, nature protection, sustainable development and a healthy lifestyle among young people. They have experience in implementing practical nature-related solutions carried out by young people in their local communities. I am Zoran from Association Arteco from Croatia. I am here like president of our organization and like participant in this project. I like to be here very much because uh, nature is uh, beautiful. I uh, discover many lovely places here. Actually, I like mountain very much. In Croatia, I don't live in a place like this, so this is for me something new. And also place where we are living now, here, where this project is beautiful and our host is very good and very nice people. Uh, so kindly to us and also trainers uh, for me networking uh, is always uh, main goal in every project uh, because uh, our uh, organization also uh, uh, work in Erasmus uh, plus projects so I always uh, try to meet new people and to connect connect with them and so this project for us is very good workshops here is also very important important for us because 
like in uh, every project we try to learn something new uh, and in this project we learn many new things um, uh, new workshops and new methods how to work with youth people my name is maria and this is my third time on a project erasmus plus uh, it's the first time for a uh, role like a facilitator and it's really cool project for me because here we develop our relationship in a group task, uh, have a good time with another countries and increase knowledge about European culture. Also, we spend a lot of time with natural, with a professional instructor and listening about interesting facts uh, about fauna and flora. So uh, I wish you come here and uh, can see and take a participate on this project. The project applicant was the Polish Initiative Foundation in Lenjine, located in the Novy Migrut commune. The partners were non-governmental organization, Artiko Pavletic, Croatia, Asociación de Vecinos, as the Miaus, Spain, Kuchisti Implicati Organization, Romania, Evolving Yos, Latvia, Health Grow Center for Personal and Cultural Development for Children and Youngsters, Bulgaria, Non-Governmental Organization Action Ukraine, and We Sound Italy.